What's up, everybody? And more importantly, what up, Dodgers Nation? Let's go, Dodgers! Yeah! All right, what's up, Dodgers Nation? It's me, Jason Alamillo. If you love what you hear, love what you see, kind of like what you see, because it's me, I'm sorry. L- like, com- <laughs> okay, uh, like, comment, share, subscribe. Here we go. It's Dodger Baseball. Um, or should I put it this way? Um, <laughs> uh, it's time for Dodger Baseball. Did a little bit weird, but that was Vince Scully. All right, here we go, ladies and gentlemen, Dodger fans. Uh, this video is, should Dodgers give Zach McKinstry more playing time? Could he be a rookie of the year? I think so. He could, and I'm going to go over it. Now, here's the thing. Zach McKinstry is a great player this year, and he is feeling a great, great man's shoes. We're going to go over that. So look, Zach McKinstry is a great player. He could play infield. He could play outfield. Everyone calls him the Zach attack or the Zach of all trades. He's doing so well right now at this moment in this season. He's slashing 545, uh, 545, 500, slugging uh 1,091, he's uh, uh, OPS in 1,591, he's got four RBIs, uh, three doubles, and um, he, he's absolutely outstanding. Now, he's getting even better, and I think the Dodgers are actually doing better with him, with Zach McKinstry in the lineup. The way he's hitting, he's doing incredibly well. He kind of reminds me of uh, Kike Hernandez and even... Uh, Matt Kemp in the beginning, but even uh, Cody Bellinger, you know, my man Belly, who's on injury right now and uh, on the uh, in the knee. Um, but like uh, now he has uh, shoes to fill, some big shoes to fill in Kike Hernandez. Uh, Kike Hernandez, uh, he's joining. And, and, and so, I mean, if you remember, he's the one who like hit like three home runs. And I think he had a three run homer in the NLDS in 2017, which got the Dodgers to the World Series. And unfortunately, Tex, uh, Texas decided to cheat. Uh, always going to be cheaters. The Astros, pretty much. Um, now, he's joining also the favorite team to win the World Series, the LA Dodgers. Um, now, he is playing like a vet. He's uh, got quality at bats, two strike, uh, uh, you know, two strike hitting. Uh, you, you know, he, he's tied for third in RBIs, tied for first in uh, doubles in just eleven at bats. That's an incredible feat. Now, look, Dodgers need to find more ways to put him. In my opinion, they need to uh, find ways to find more ways to put him out there, give him more playing time, and. Um, and more at bats because this dude is absolutely incredible. If they do do this, if they do actually give him that playing time, put him in the outfield to defend balls, to uh, to defend the bases, you know, stopping balls from say, someone like uh, 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 Tati um, uh, from from the uh, the the San Diego Padres and and all of the all of those guys. If if he could do that, if they could put him out there or put him in the put him in the inf- put him in the infield, let him hit a couple of sluggers, a couple of bombs out there, some Zach attacks, absolutely Austria, like just a- eliminate those balls, obliterate them. I think he could be a contender for the rookie of the year. Now look, he, look, th- this is what Cody Bellinger did. What he ate thirty seven hundred. I'm sorry, thirty. I wish 37, 38 home runs. So in his first year. 2017 2018 so look he did incredibly well um and this could be zach mckinstry's year now look zach mckinstry actually has a great story he was in the 30 30 i'm sorry he was in the 33rd round of the uh in the uh 2016 draft he's still not as uh, it's still not as low as joe piazza joe piazza was at was picked in the 62nd round. So, look, I think Zach McKinstry is an amazing player. He's got great skills. He knows how to hit the ball. He knows how to pay attention to the pitch, whether if it's a curveball, whether if it's a nice, nasty slider, whether it's going at 95 or 106 miles an hour, uh, whether it's a it's a nice, you know, kind of backhand slider, wh- whatever it is, 
A nice kind of chopper from the pitcher. He's got it. He's got it. And he's able to hit the ball. And I think and he's got great running skills. He can play all parts of the diamond. So I think he needs to be uh, in in the in the play, in the game every single day. He needs more time. He needs to get his record up. And I hope Doc finds a way. Dave Roberts finds a way to put him in there. We need him in there just as much as we need Chris Taylor, Cody Bellinger, uh, Justin Turner. Although Justin Turner, I mean, he's doing good, but Corey Seager, especially, who is the MVP of the NLD, NLDS and the World Series, absolutely needs to be. Uh, Zach McKinstry, uh, McKinstry needs to be in the um, in the uh, uh, in, in the games a lot more. If uh, he needs to be Rookie of the Year, I think he should. Let me know in the comments below. Do you think Zach McKinstry should be playing more often? If so, how often do you think he could be Rookie of the Year? And give me your best guesses. How many RBIs do you think he's going to have? And what position do you think he plays better in? Infield, outfield, or both? All right, everybody, that is my Dodgers video for today. Make sure to give me a like, comment, share, and subscribe. There's going to be a lot more coming, especially in the summer. All right, thanks.